questions. 16. S and T are points on the circumference of a circle. There and there. Uh, Centre O, which is there. PT is a tangent to the circle. So PT is this line there. It's a tangent to the circle because it goes directly off a circle. SOP is a straight line. SOP, straight line. Angle OPT is 32 degrees. So OPT, so that's that angle there, which you can see, 32 degrees. Work out the size of the angle marked X. Give reasons for your answer. So very important you actually give reasons for your answer. The reasons are not the working out. The reasons are something that you're going to write down as a sentence. So, what we got? We got 32 degrees. We've got a tangent. And we've got a radius. Now, we know that this is 90 degrees. Why do we know that? Because of the circle theorem that a tangent of a circle and a radius of a circle meet at 90 degrees. They are perpendicular to each other. Okay? So remember, how are we actually going to find that? Well, this is a triangle formed with a radius and another, another radius. They're the same length, which means this triangle is isosceles, which means that angle there is the same as that angle there. Now if I know this angle here, then when you take that from 180, what's left will be these two. So divided by 2, we'll find that one. And I can find this angle if I knew this angle. And I can find this angle because I know that's 90 and I know that's 32. So, I'm going to write uh, OTP equals 90 degrees. My reason for knowing that is that uh, radius and tangent of a circle meet at 90 degrees. So there's a reason. That's good. So we can find this angle here, uh, TOP. TOP is equal to um, those two added together, so uh, taking away from 180 degrees. So 180 take away those two added together, 90 plus 32. 90 plus 32 is 122, so 180 take away 122 is equal to. 58 degrees. So I'll put that in there. TOP is 58 degrees. Um, I'm just going to write down angles in a triangle uh, add to 180 degrees. So there's another reason. Uh, now I can find that one there by because you've got a straight line. So that angle there, SOT, SOT is equal to 180 take away 58. Well, that's actually going to be 122 again, because 180 take away 122 is 58. So 180 take away 58 must be 122 degrees. Uh, angles on a straight line add to 180 degrees. Now the mark scheme won't actually give you marks for every single one of these but it definitely wants that one and it usually wants one more so the best thing to do is write down everything you know. So we knew that the radius and the tangent meet at 90 degrees so you write it down. We knew the angles in a triangle add to 180 degrees so we write it down. We know the angles in the straight line add to 180 degrees, so we write it down. So, SOT is 1, 2, 2 degrees. Now we're going to find X by doing 180 take away 1, 2, 2, which again is 58 degrees, and then dividing it by 2. 58, oops, 58 degrees divided by 
2 is equal to 29 degrees. Uh, my reason is that the angles of the sleeve triangle have two equal angles. But I don't think I need to write that down. No, we might as well. Uh, I saw Skiller's triangles have two equal angles. So it's 29 degrees.